Hello YouTube and welcome to this new video. Today for my review of the filamentum non-island filament. In this video I want to talk about its general specs, then I want to make myself a print profile for my Ender 3, print a Benji with it and then talk about what I am going to use it for in the future. Let's get started. Let me start with telling you something about its general specs. The filament itself costs 40 euros for 750 grams. That seems quite expensive for filament. But let me tell you what it can. It should be high temperature resistant up to 110 degrees Celsius. Also it should be high temperature liquid resistant which is pretty cool. Despite that it should be dishwasher safe which we surely gonna test out. And it is food safe, so you can drink your hot coffee from it. And also it's fully biodegradable. Let us pack it open. In the box we've got a letter right here. Oh, you can see it. With the general specs, I think. Yes. Here you can see it's general specs like the print speed and something. And here you can see the biodegradability or recyclability. And then we also got the filament right here in a aluminium bag. Let's get it out. As you can see this is an aluminium bag and here you can see it is um, reclosable. And that's pretty cool. And you got this thing here. Which I think is a sticker, which would be super cool. Yeah, that must be a sticker. Or a tag, I'm not quite sure. Oh no, it's a sticker, you can see that here. As a print profile, I just modified the generic PLA one in Cura. For that, I just changed the nozzle temperature to 180 degrees Celsius and the bed temperature to 40 degrees Celsius. And then I changed the build plate adhesion to raft because I thought that's useful. And also the layer height to 0.16 millimeters. And that's all. The print has just finished. Have a look. I think it looks awesome. It's maybe the best print I've ever made. And now let's see how it goes off the build plate. As they said, there may be some problem for that. But as you can see, it goes off kind of. The Benji itself goes off that thing better than that thing from the build plate. But let's see how it goes off from the build plate. And as you can see, there aren't huge problems there. No, not at all. It goes off pretty easily. And as you can see, there's not really anything left on the build plate. But let's take a look at the Benji. I think it looks very good and there's not even really stringing. Just a little bit, but less than on most other prints. And yeah. I think that's a huge success. Now I want to know what happens if I pour boiling water over the Benji. Let's try that out. As you could see, I boiled some water. Boiled it in a kettle, so it was at hot as it could get. And do you think there are any deformations at the Benchy? Comment if you want. So here are the results. And no, I couldn't find any deformation at all. It stayed rock solid and even this thin part didn't move at all. Even though I pressed on it really hard with a stick. And um, that's impressive, isn't it? I think so. The last thing I want to try in this video is if it survives the dishwasher. And in general I wouldn't recommend drinking from a 3D printed cup before you dishwash it once. 
including a cup made from non oil. So if it survives or not, we'll find out now. Next day in a dishwasher later. And as you can see, the Benji looks still awesome. The details are still completely there and yeah, the Benji looks great. Now to my conclusion. For 40 euros, this filament isn't cheap, but I really like it. It is so unique and you can do with it things you couldn't do with any other filament. And for that I think 40 euros is okay. And what do I want to do with it in the future? As an example, I have this cap, which I printed just now. And this is super cool because you couldn't do it with any other filament and you can drink your coffee from it and it's great. And what I want to do later, I want to try to print an arrow press with that and yeah that would be super cool if that works but that's another video. Anyways, I hope you liked this video and goodbye.